what's up welcome back to the channel so it is that time of the month girl you already know it's been a long month it's been a busy month and your girl's been trying some new stuff so i thought i'd come at you today with another active favorites i know you guys love these videos and i really just love to share everything that i'm currently loving at the moment kind of give you guys some ideas for yourself in case you're looking for something new to spice up your active game with. You know what I'm saying? Got a variety as always going on here. So I'm just gonna randomly dip and dive and grab whatever I got here in this mound that I got going on near my feet. But before I begin, please do hit that subscribe button because I do make new videos every single week. And also maybe give this video a like if you happen to like it. I'm just gonna start with, you already know, Gymshark baby. So guys, I got this I think over a month ago and I've been using this I kid you not every single solitary day <gasps> I believe this was only like $25 this backpack it is a Gymshark mini like lifestyle backpack and I bring it to the gym with me because it's perfect for everything I need it has thin straps no biggie okay I'm not carrying around textbooks in here this ain't a back-to-school backpack okay if you got heavy things you're lugging around Girl, don't even think about it. Yes, so you got the thin straps, a lot of like hidden compartments, which I like. You got a side pocket right here. The only thing I wish, I do wish that the pocket was big enough to put a water bottle in, but it's a, it's a mini lifestyle bag, bag, okay. I don't really like bringing in like big duffel bags anymore and things that you just gotta like lug on the side. I don't like that. My body feels whack-a-doodle and it doesn't make me feel good so I like a nice convenient backpack you know what I'm saying yep you got your big compartment in here is packed with stuff right now okay I got my fanny pack when I go for walks my almonds because your girl's always hungry my beets everything you got a small little pocket inside here for extra personal things you know maybe womanly things you know something like that you even got like this hidden back like sleeve pocket in here I got mints you know and then a front pocket so yeah you got a lot going on here it is literally my best friend okay I bring it to the gym throw it in the locker mm, good to go gym shark next on the list guys I'm going to go ahead and share with you something I've been wearing more or less casually not necessarily to the gym and it's actually really funny if you guys follow me on Instagram you would already know I posted a picture wearing these and it's a really funny story that goes along with this, okay? Got these Gold's Gym shorts, okay? Where I'm lounging around the house. I do wear them out and about. It is still hot as heck here in Pennsylvania. So you bet your bum that I'm wearing it out and about. But I don't really, haven't worn it to the gym yet. I'm just, I'm not really big into wearing shorts at the gym. I don't know. So my bae, James, bought these shorts for himself, okay? I kid you not, for himself off of Amazon. And he bought them because they were advertised as men's bodybuilding shorts till he got them in the mail and he tried them on. These are a large in men's, mind you. He tried them on and um, <laughs> let's just say, <sighs> let's just not say. <laughs> it, was, it was really bad, it was really bad. So rather than returning them, I tried them on and I fell in love because they're just enough loose on me because I don't really like things restricting and cutting into my gut. So. These actually are my new bay. Okay, I love these. Nice solid black, goes with anything. Gold's Gym for the win. They were $8 on Amazon. By the way, I'll have every single thing linked down below for you guys in case you happen to like something you see. So what do you guys think? You know, do you think James should keep them? Wear my short shorts? What do you think I rock them better? Who do you think rocks them better? Be honest, comment down below. I wanna know your thoughts. Okay guys, so next up on the list, this is not necessarily an active type of product, but for what I use it for, it's definitely, it correlates, okay? It is a portable IPL hair removal system, okay? And if you don't know what that is, it's basically laser hair removal, portable style, okay? Same thing, like you know, if you go to a salon, you get your laser treatments done, same idea, just the convenience of having it from home, okay? This is from the brand Exo Beauty, and it comes in a beautiful box like this. So thank you to Exo Beauty for sponsoring this portion of today's video. I'm having a lot of fun with this thing, I'm not gonna lie. The thing with this is you can't be having a tan on 
any kind of tan, natural or artificial tan. You can't have one of those babies on you while you use this. So I'm waiting for my tan to fade, but I've been using it under my armpits, okay? I don't mean to be disgusting and maybe it's a little TMI, but for some reason, your girl forgets to shave under her armpits. It's weird. I remember to shave my legs and everything like that, but for some reason, I'll be literally at the gym about to lift a dumbbell and I'll go like this and look at myself in the mirror and go, oh my God, I literally forgot to shave again. So I'm really, <laughs> I'm really glad <laughs> that I got this baby. It's super easy, it's super convenient. You could bring it with you on vacation for crying out loud. It does take about a month to see results. So it's something you have to do like once or twice a week, keep up with it. Then after a few months, your hair just ain't gonna be growing back, okay? So I thought it was really cool. It comes with these glasses right here because the flash is pretty, pretty bright. So yeah, I will definitely have this baby linked down below as well. The reviews on this are amazing and I will definitely keep you guys up to date with this bad boy, okay? Next up on the list, whoo, your girl finally got lifting shoes. Oh my God. If you've been watching my channel for a while now, you would know that I would say in the beginning of this year, I finally invested in Converse flash shoes so that I can use it for my lifting days, just lower body in general. It's better to have flash shoes because it will help you to sit back into your heels better and push through the weight, target different muscles, the right muscles. So I truly believe in that. I know for a fact that even being barefoot really works and helps significantly because when you have arched shoes and sneakers your body is ever so slightly tilted a certain way so when you're trying to do these lower body compound workouts you're putting pressure on what the parts that you really don't want to be working out okay so like more like towards your quads and your knees and things like that so sitting back definitely helps it'll help activate your muscles like your glute muscles better that is why flat shoes are the way to go. And Rider Wear, thank you so much to Rider Wear for hooking me up with these. I am obsessed and I wear these on every single lower body slash lifting day, okay? They're cool, they're different, okay? This is in a size six and a half women's and I'm usually a size six, but what I like is it still fits perfectly. There's a little bit of room, okay? But these are meant to be a little roomy. I don't know if you guys have any experience. I'm gonna tell you guys how I experienced uh, wearing Converse. Converse are great because they're flat, but they're also very restrictive. There's no wiggle room at all, okay? So it's very, very compact. So that's great and all, but when it comes to lifting, when you're putting pressure on your feet, they're actually spreading out significantly, okay? So this is your foot and you're pressing it into the ground and you're gonna be spreading out. You need a little bit of extra room to allow that to happen. So I love that these are designed for that, okay? In a nutshell, these are lifting shoes that are specifically designed for lifting heavy, okay? Girl, you're an athlete, okay? You need to invest in yourself and you need to hook yourself up with what is needed in order to accomplish what you wanna accomplish. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, loving these. They have different colors. These are in gray. All right, guys, next up, I got this bad boy on Amazon. Ooh, yes. Yeah, we got stuff hanging out of it. Don't mind it. Mm -hmm. What we're looking at here is a barbell pad. This is from the brand Gymletics, and I love it because it was very inexpensive. Okay, it was like 20, I think this was like $20 around there, 25. Not really sure, but I'll have it linked down below. And what I love is it doesn't just come with a barbell pad, okay? It comes with two ankle straps here, okay? Super convenient um, if you are in a busy gym. Gotta share these with other people. Some people are germaphobes, don't wanna share sweaty little ankle straps. I don't blame you, it's all good. It's good to have your own, just in case, you never know. I know the gym I go to, it's just they're always tethered to death and um, the Velcro lost its Velcro-ness. It's good to just, you know, kind of have your own, your own thing going on here, you know what I'm saying? It comes with a really, really heavy duty resistance band. Look at this. This is the heaviest resistance band I've ever owned. <laughs> and it has a grip lining inside, which is nice. So, oh my gosh, look how thick that is. It's, 
that's a hard resistance. Woo! Oh man, I'm gonna be really honest with you. The girl hates latex resistance bands. They just roll up on you, they snap, they scare me, they're just, they catch me off guard when they do that. And it just, it just hurts, okay? It's uncomfortable and it's really not necessary. So, you got a heavy duty resistance band, baby. And then of course, you know, the man of the hour, the barbell pad. Yes. This is not a Velcro barbell pad. It is open on the one side here. Got a nice indentation right here for your neck in case you wanna use it to squat. Okay. I have three gym memberships, okay? <laughs> I know it's crazy, but each one serves its own purpose. Okay, you got one that's really close to home. I got another one that has everything I need. And you got the one that's a backup when the other really good ones closed. Long story short, two out of three of the gyms that I go to don't have these. You know, not all of them have them. So, gotta invest in your own baby. Uh, whether it comes to squatting or hip thrusts, things like that, this is my go-to. I mean, if you don't have one of these and you don't feel like buying one, you can always roll around like a yoga mat. That works just the same way. I just don't have patience for that. <laughs> I just, mm-mm, no. Saving one of the best for last. So. What I've been loving this month and wearing a lot this month, a lot, a lot to the gym, is the Women's Best Power Seamless. Oh, absolutely, okay. This one's in red. I love their power collection, okay? Their power collection is really great. It's squat proof, it's super comfortable, got a very, very nice material going on. Ribbed waist, you got a little bit of contour, very, very, subtle contour but it's still there right around right on the under booty right where i like and need the contour wraps around this way you got the women's best logo the sports bra super cute matches it as well i love strappy sports bra girl i love it it's sexy and again you got the matching rib detail right here guys this is overall a very very supportive set I love it. It's very huggy, so it'll hug you in all the right places. This I feel like gives me like that hourglass shape where some some brands might just kind of crush everything and you're like, where'd my everything go? <laughs> this does the opposite, okay? It really is a flattering set. And guys, I just want to add this in as a little sneak peek into the Women's Best Power Collection. Their new khaki color. It's coming out. September 9th is when you can get this color, guys. So it's not out quite yet. The red is though. Okay. If you guys aren't aware, I do work with Women's Best. So I have a little bias. All right, I'm not gonna lie, but I love them. And I have for a while now. So the khaki color, which is like an olive green, this khaki screams full time, you guys. Full, this is getting me so amped right now. Got the long sleeve in this one, kind of mix it up a little bit. And it does have little thumb holes right here. I love that, keeps everything nice and tight. And of course, feeling like a badass. So, the stretch on this is unreal. It'll fit you in all the right places. So absolutely loving new colors. They're coming out with a light pink and a nude as well. So I'm gonna try to get my hands on the nude color. But for right now, loving the khaki, guys. So look out for that September 9th. All right, guys, that was it. Those were my monthly active favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys got some new ideas of different active brands to try out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.